Hey there, everyone. Happy Friday to you. I'm meteorologist Adrian Vaughn with Fox 26 in Houston. And as we head through the next couple of days, we're continuing to see things stay quiet in the tropics. Some good news for us. We like to see it. No tropical cyclone formation is expected as we head through the next five days. And the National Hurricane Center does not have too much, even in the way of looking at, out towards the Pacific either. Just two weak disturbances out that direction that may turn into something as we get towards the middle of next week. But in the Atlantic side of things, it's really all because of the Saharan dust that continues to roll through. We've got another big plume now coming off the coast of Africa that makes its move across the central Pacific or the central Atlantic rather as we get through uh, the upcoming weekend. It'll start to uh, arrive out across the leeward and the Antilles as we get towards uh, the beginning of early next week. So we'll be watching that could impact us here locally as we get into the the middle to end of next week, but uh, certainly the Saharan dust continues to limit that activity in the Atlantic Basin and as mentioned in the Pacific Basin, not a whole lot to talk about there either. We just have two weak areas uh, that do bear some watching, but even the National Hurricane Center not too gung ho on development, perhaps gradually as we get into next week, but uh, this area just a 10% chance as we get through the next couple of days and this area is a little bit more elongated that one. Uh, just giving it a 30% chance as we get through the next five days and a 0% chance in the next two days. So uh, those are two that we'll be watching, but again, uh, not to be a concern, certainly for us here locally. As we move forward, we know things can change and change quickly. We're just now getting towards the end of July. You'll notice that the climatology really ramps up quickly as we get through the month of August and September and even into the early part of October. That's when we see the bulk of our hurricane development. So while things are quiet now, we know that can certainly change as we get into the next couple of weeks. Hey, if you haven't already downloaded that Fox 26 weather app, go ahead and do that. You can always check in and check in on that local forecast at any time. And also you can follow along on social media.